You know, a lot of us have dark areas inside our house and we don't think we can grow any types of houseplants, but guess what? You can. There are so many different types of houseplants that have been hybridized so you can grow them in shade areas. For example, of course, which is most common, but I still love them, is the mother-in-law's tongue, which you can almost grow in a dark closet. And the reason why they call it that name is because supposedly if you eat and suck the juices from the leaf, it numbs your vocal cords. Thus, mother-in-law's tongue, because we like to have our mother-in-laws not talk so much. Uh, anyways, we have the peace lily, which of course is very common, and I love using the peace lily even in outside pots during the summertime, especially if you have a dark covered porch. Look how beautiful this plant is. It's elegant and it cascades down. It's great to put on high cabinets and things like that. It's an alternative to English ivy, and I find it grows better inside than English ivy because we don't have the mite problem, that type of thing. Then of course we have the pothos, which are still very common, but they're wonderful because they can also grow basically in a dark closet. Plus, there's so many different varieties of this plant. But don't forget bromeliads. We're used to the common bromeliad that you find at the grocery store, but here's something different for you. This is called Bailbergia, and it is a uh, bromeliad, and this is the easiest thing. It grows almost like Bermuda grass. So here's just a few types of houseplants for you to grow in your shady areas indoors. I'm Chris Olson, and you're watching today's home.